Good evening. Friendos, it's time for Quest for Semi-Glory. We're starting a new game tonight, since we're done with Wizard of Legend. This is Star Renegades. Um, all I know about this is that it's an RPG. Uh, we've been playing a lot of action-y games uh, lately. I figure it's time to have ourselves an adventure. Maybe, uh, you know, do a little story, yell at some NPCs, that sort of thing. I know that there is an opening cutscene to this, or an opening little cinematic, so we're gonna watch that first. We'll, we'll see what we got. See if this is like story related, relevant. I imagine it is, but what are we what are we dealing with here? Looks pretty as hell. At least the rendering of the cinematic, huh? Oh shit! Start off strong emotions here. Oh, there's no way she's surviving that. Oh, oh, that's that's rough. Okay. I guess that this is gonna be us, right? It's the protag. Big protag energy right here. Oh, caught one on the cheek there. Oh, okay. Explains the scar. Shit. Her, her mom didn't die. Presumably that's her mother. I don't know. Got the other half of the thing. <laughs> oh, that crap. Okay, well, that leaves a, a few questions uh, unanswered, but that's the that's the opening cinematic, I guess. Let's, let's give this a play. Give this a play, and they'll probably treat us to another, like, new game cinematic type thing or whatever, I'd imagine. We'll let it play out. Maybe it'll inform us here. Ooh, that's pretty. I like this aesthetic, too. Kinda chunky pixely, but kinda not. Ooh. We did some space battles too. Maybe that's getting ahead of myself though. We'll see. Oh shit. Oh, that thing's. Oh, kaboom! <laughs> Ruh -roh. Um. That's a big ass problem. Yeah, run away. Those lasers were no joke. Oh shit. Uh oh. Or uh, presumably that's gonna be us again. We're, we're going down. We got hit. Uh, small force of mysterious raiders destroys the Marty starring in Nevada. Showing Starfighters attempt to regroup pursued by everyone sending squadrons. Okay. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Oh, that's very pretty too. Uh, I'm still alive. Okay, so we are we are win Cyphex. Um Okay, presumably that's gonna be our brother, uh, just based on last names there, Davy and Sypha. Uh, more fighters in our tail, where are they coming from? Landed by a train, if I can get the base in time. There's anti-aircraft guns online, hell yeah! Let's go turn on some AA! Why not? Help our presumed brother out. <laughs> hey, game over, how you doing? Good to see ya. Oh, okay, so now we get control here. Oh! That's interesting. All right, so quick button check. We get a look around. Oh, oh, we get to highlight stuff too. Uh, and presumably talk to them if we walk over to the butts. Let's look at our ship. It's fucking shit can, pretty much. Not the best to use of taxpayer credits. Well, I mean, it's, it's all busted. All busted up. We took a pretty nasty spill there. Uh, British from another dimension just destroyed our amount, but I think we should hear out what they plan to do. Eh. Yeah, right. Something. Here the governor just tells us some mysteriously just appears out of nowhere. We've had some laws confiscating 
Massive stockpiles of mega nuclear material, even though it's my right to own it. Okay. What is this? The U.S. circa 20 years from now? Probably. Um, now what else can we do here? So move, look, uh, hold the run. Okay, move faster. Use squad. We can't do that yet. Hold my to reset location. Oh, okay, the fax is there. Options. Let's see what we got for options. Oh, literally the menu, huh? Oh, and all the system stuff. Okay, no, well, we're, we're good there. True to form, we will stay away from the critical path, probably. And 1,700 credits running on the Armada. You know, to do a last second short. Oh, boy. Okay. Well, presumably they don't want me to go pretty much anywhere else. Yeah, we're, we're penned in this tiny-ass area. Hey, there's man, could you please send someone to clear that smoking wreckage? We have children here. Yeah, I'll get right on it. Not that my life's in danger or anything. Uh, use the train, sure. Strange signatures on that train. They aren't commuters. Okay, well. Doesn't matter. Let's, let's have a fight. Oh, yeah, it's one of the weirdo robot things from the opening cutscene. Uh, let's see how they, uh, how they are at hand-to-hand -hand combat. Well, they've got a gun, so I, I don't think they'll be doing the to the hand-to-hand -hand combat. Prepare to meet my doom. <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, sh sure. Yeah, all right. <clears throat> okay, so tutorial bits, right? It's deterministic, and you can see your enemy's actions before they execute. Okay, interesting. Defend, crit, stagger, or break them. All actions are displayed in the timeline according to execution time. Okay, so not... Not active time battle. This is like it must be turn-based, huh? I'm into that. I can get down with a good turn-based game, huh? His current health is shown in the status bars. Shields, health, and armor. Shields regenerate at the end of every combat. Armor can only be damaged after shields are depleted. Health and armor can be healed or repaired during camping, or from health kits and armor stations spawned for the mission. Okay. Okay. Uh alright, I see. So yeah, it's, it's, oh, he's charging up his, his laser there. Um, let's, um, I guess all we can do is cleave, right? It's the tutorial. Sure, do it. Uh, wait, let's back up there. Um, oh, I see. It even previews, like, what kind of hit we're going to take to our shield in the lower left there. I see. And it looks like it's going to, or that attack's going to crit me, huh? Oh. Well, I guess I have no choice. But, all right, let's fine. Let's clean. Hey, Kenny, how you doing? Let's see. Ya. All right, let's do it. That's the only option they give me. Oh, bzz. yeah, crit for 19. Got it. Oh, and then it's my turn. Whoa, bam! 35, bitch. Take that. And then next turn. You may have done that. I should probably hit him before he hits me. Okay. Yeah, probably. <laughs> crit occurs when a unit is hit before they can execute their action. All right. Crit bonus is applied, shown below the attacking power's main information. Oh, okay. Well, hopefully all this is going to be conveyed outside these dialogues here. Uh, crits do extra damage, break the enemy's attack, pierce shields or armor, damage armor, or have other devastating effects. Enemies can also crit your heroes if they're hit before they can execute. Yeah, we just saw that. That's just what happened there. Alright, so it's slash, presumably. is Okay, so it hits before he does, and it moves his action back. It's like two ticks there. So I. Uh, so 13, crit bonus 13 and one armor break, I guess. All right, do it. Bam, get slashed, idiot. Oh, nice. Our shields are fucking toast. Oh, and then he gets fire at me, but our shields are still fine. We're only about half six. Guys, smash him with a hue to break him and stall his attack. All right. Attacks can stagger an enemy's action, delaying it to execute later in the round, allowing your squad to execute more actions crits, blah 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 blah. Okay. The amount of stagger and attack of the crits is shown in green. Okay, yeah. 60 seconds per round. I get it. I got it. Uh with careful landing and chain attacks together to land multiple staggers on an enemy and break them by pushing them into the next round. Hell yeah. Uh, they have a stagger limit, depending how many times they can be staggered before they are immune. This is shown in the timeline, blah 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 blah. Uh, stagger limit increases again after they execute their action. Enemies cannot be staggered beyond the end of the next round. I see. Okay. Alright, so, uh, yeah. Bleed this fuck. Also, uh, stagger him into next week. I mean, next turn. Oh! Erect. Hell yeah. And he's bleeding. <laughs> 
I don't know how a robot can bleed. Maybe this isn't a robot. Maybe this is just a, a dude in a fucking robo suit. All right. So with what we've learned, we should attack before he gets to attack and ensure... Oh, and it even tells us he's going to get murdered by this. That's good. All right. Moited. Oh, kaboom. Excellent. We did it. And then our shield recharges. We didn't take any armor or health damage. So yeah, we're good. Good to go. It was some kind of EMP. Well, at least the coast is clear. Eh? <laughs> Damn it. Not clear. Anyway, advancing at least we can take them out in the fight. Let's see what I do against this next one. I, he looks like a bigger boy. Looks like a bigger boy. But you know what? We'll fight him in due time. We've got to go look at this question mark. I should have exposed one of those Titan hands. Oh, I see. It's like on the terrain there. Cool. I guess it's just flavor text. There's one down here as well. Alright. Can we sneak attack? Oh, I see. That just progresses us to the next battle. All right, go. Sneak up on. Put it. Put the giant laser sword in his back. Whoa, he is big. Holy hell. Uh, we're gonna make burn. Yeah, we'll see about that. Um, uh, okay. Well, um, yeah, we'll get to bash him pretty good before he gets to attack. So it'll be a crit. 18, 18 extra damage, three to armor, and a 10 second delay. I'm reading all that right, yeah? Oh, bam! Oh, but he resisted it, because he's a big boy, probably. Oh, jeez. Too hot. Oh, that was... That was a big hit. <laughs> Whoops, that didn't work! <laughs> uh, alright. All attacks are core damage types, it depends on kind of attack it is. They are light, normal, heavy, flurry, AoE, counter, and combo. Series may be weak to specific core damage types and take extra damage. At least, however, they can also be resistant or even immune. Alright. Get it? I see. So normal, light, heavy, normal, and yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Um. Does it tell me? Oh, yeah, okay. It says weak versus light. Um. Should have paid attention to that when we did our first attack. Oh, well. Alright, so weak versus light. Fuck, fuck him up. Fuck him up. Yeah. You wrecked, idiot. Alright. Broken into the next turn, and he's bleeding. And slash for another break. I really okay. We're still technically tutorial zone here, right? Um, all right. And it's weak versus normal. I saw there quickly. Bam! Shields are down. Broken again. Break limit is empty. So much for delaying. Onto, okay, I see. So now we delayed him two turns. He's now immune. And now we would be best off defending, of course, because that's what it's telling us to do. Oh, I see. It looks like all of our abilities slash attacks have cooldowns as well. Alright. Uh, 40% defense. Yeah, sure. Oh, jeez. Alright, our shields are toast. I think our armor took a bop there as well. Uh, armor absorbs damage before it reaches health. The amount of damage that can be absorbed per hit is equal to the amount of armor they have. Okay. Um, okay, and then they give us a breakdown. 56. Uh, shields take the brunt of it, and then the armor, and then it goes against health. I get it. Oh, I get it. Uh, attacks can cause armor damage on a crit. Display the amount of armor damage down in the text details. Okay. Some attacks are elemental damage types can pierce armor. Um, well, it doesn't damage the armor, it bypasses it, and does damage to health instead. Okay, yep. Got it. Uh, Sunder, so... 10... Well, 20 damage, with an additional 10 damage, 8 to armor, and then a 15 second delay. Huh? Okay. Nice. Armor broken. And pushed in the next turn. Q. Alright, then of course, act before he does, and he'll be toast, right? Kaboom! Eat shit, you big-ass tanky fuck. Alright. Use his guns right about now, I got a trail of fighters. Yeah, I'm working on it! I'm busy exploring the world, buddy! 
Hold on. Just like do a few barrel rolls and loop the loops or whatever. Hold them off until I can get the guns online. Uh, most of these for training. Yeah, okay. Uh, that was the next area, I see. All right? Okay. Oh, huh? We go around back. Oh, that would have been sneaky. Okay. You know, we could do the critical thing and turn on the AA gun so our brother doesn't get blasted out of the sky, but you know what? Let's walk around a bit. Half a mind to be on the lookout for secrety secrets, right? But I guess we should turn on the guns. Let's turn on the guns. Oh, that was easy. Well, hopefully the guns don't target him. Oh, well, oops, this could be a problem. Oh, uh oh. Oh no, what's that? Oh yeah, exactly. See, hopefully the guns don't target him. Oh, that's no good. Oh, too late. He's fucking toast. Hopefully he survived. Okay, he survived. He's fine! <laughs> it's fine. Um... Oh, shit. But now we get two people, now we can beat the shit out of this idiot. Ooh. It's weird. <laughs> like, but it's not like, sounds like that, right? Not time for Joe to find his weakness and exploit it again and again. Yeah, alright. <clears throat> well, and in, oh, inspection mode. I have these units' traits and effects to see what weaknesses, strengths, resistance, immunities. Uh, targeting you has shown a prediction of the outcome of your actions on that enemy for that round. Your actions will presumably result in death of the enemy. Kill shot indicator, okay, yeah, we knew about that. Late kill indicator means the enemy will execute their action before dying. Ah. Damage prediction and kill shot indicator are not always 100% accurate. Oh, good. I thought they said all this shit was deterministic. I have a feeling I was lied to. Uh, as many things, heals, damage, debuffs, defense, buffs can happen before the final blow lands, resulting in a changed outcome. Oh, okay. So it's probably still deterministic, we just need to pay attention to the order of operations here. That's fine. Okay, um, inspect. Right trigger. There we go. Okay. Um. Uh. And left trigger. Uh, weak versus heavy, and resists light attacks. Got it. Okay, he's got laser eyes, which, sure, he's also got two big-ass laser guns there. Uh, I understand the energy health, lock for shields and armor, and yada 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 yada, okay. 189 shield, 157 health. Uh, and we are partially beat up the way it is. Well, our brother who just crash-landed is a little shaken up, he's down 22 health, no, 42 health. Alright, um, let's see what we have here, then. So, what was it? It was weak. Weak against heavy, and strong against light attacks. Okay, got it. Uh, flurry, AoE, heavy. Um, which will not land before he gets to go. Um. So why don't we blade throw, I guess? Oh, okay, I see, and it looks like it predicts what their action is going to be, too. So it's going to, he's going to attack us, the Protag. So maybe it doesn't really matter. So let's wind up a heavy attack. And then, oh, and then we get to go, okay. Um, we could wind up two heavy attacks, or... Uh... We could crit him such that... Here. 25 versus 20. Plus it shifts him back 20, so that's two ticks, right? So then our, then our bro's heavy attack will land before uh, he gets to go. So yeah, let's just do a slash. Bonk! Punch him back in the queue to make this heavy attack land. There we go. 
gets broken back in the next week. Hey, next turn. Hmm. <clears throat> so then. Uh, 25, plus 25% versus whatever, right? Resistances haven't changed. Uh, okay. I don't think we're gonna... Siphon Stab? Probably, I might be able to break him back before that attack now as well. Oh, we've also got combo moves, huh? Can we not do that? We can't do that. I guess we haven't been tutorialized on combo moves yet, so we can't use it. Let's do Blade Throw. Um, and then... He's... Hmm. Resistant to light attacks, right? So he's almost certainly not gonna... Probably just gonna plink right off him. But... It should give me the 30 second pushback for him. Is that what I'm seeing here? I know it's gonna resist, but maybe it'll be enough. Who knows? Let's try it. Bonk! Okay, he resisted it, but... Oh, see, it didn't uh, do the, the pushback, the little break. Ooh. All right, rip his shields at least. Okay, here's the tutorializing on the combo bits here. All right, I want to have a window doing. So well, now's a good time to try it out on this big bad fucker. All right, uh, let's make sure we generated enough fury first. I see. Generate fury by landing crits and breaks. Crits generate one fury, while breaks generate three fury. Uh, use fury to execute special actions or combo maneuvers. All right. Uh, cost here and execute by two of your heroes simultaneously. Each combo can ex only be executed once per encounter, huh? Uh, available for heroes that have strong relationships. Can be increased during camp. Oh no, there's relationships and shit? Aww. Well, as I was playing a Fire Emblem game. Um, okay, can we do that? I guess we can do it. Yeah, let's, uh, does that execute immediately? That's gonna show back. All right, do it. Bonk, bonk. Damn. It's broken into the next uh, turn. Well, he's toast anyways. I didn't notice and or see the uh, kill shot indicator. No matter. But all right, that fucker's toast. Oh, oh, we're fighting an another dude just right away, huh? Okay. I'll take care of this guy. What he lacks in charisma, he makes up for in hideousness. Ah, I get it. I don't want to see it. I think she has no interest in the female. Yeah, we'll see about that. Oh, why are you doing the soul? We need to work together to defeat. Yeah, why would you? If you have a two-person party, why would you be like, no, no, I got this. Like, no, just fucking let's murder this guy together. Um, respect first, though. Uh. Oh, no weaknesses, apparently. Um, that's troublesome. But alright, uh, heavy attack is at the end. Blade throw looks like simultaneous, so, you know, whatever. It's not saying he's weak or resistant to it. Alright, okay. Blade throw, I guess. And then, uh... No one can do either. Also does bleeding. I like bleeding. Like putting the the bleed on shit, right? Uh, well, we've got two attacks that could, in theory, push him back a little bit, right? Also sunder. Okay, let's uh. Well, let's make sure this happens, I guess. Bonk! Did it push him back in the queue a little bit? Yeah, it did. Bonk, bonk! Oh, 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 jeez, 96. Oh, good thing he's got a lot of shield, though. <laughs> the results are inevitable. Yeah, you're gonna get your ass beat. That's the inevitable result, I think. Uh, actually, I don't know. What, what does he have for... Oh, shit, he's got, like, fucking... 
massive shields. Well, no, sh he's level 10, no wonder. Oh, and he's gonna kill shot uh, our dude here. Da Davian? Davian. What? Oh, okay. Well, I'm, I imagine this is scripted to, to end this way, but... Um, go out swinging, I guess, yeah. Uh, go, go out... Go out swinging. Um... Ah, that's... Sunder, I guess? You push him into next week, right? There we go. Bonk! Oh, that didn't... That didn't break him into the next turn, unfortunately. Well, bye, Davian! Oh shit, he's fucking dosed! <laughs> Yeah, he's, he's fucking myrtleized. I mean, the good news is, we as the Protag survived. The extremely scripted first boss ish encounter, I guess. Alright, there are going to be details on the Imperium hierarchy and all the currently known leaders, behemoths, and adversaries. Oh boy. And how will be brought here to witness events such as deaths, promotions, introductions? Also, access to the Imperium throne and direct from the main menu. Interesting. Okay, so story bits, right? Um, there's the elite soldiers, stronger, tougher, and unique special traits and abilities, unique personalities. Uh, they can also be promoted, evolve, and grow stronger whenever they are able to defeat you. So they're usually guarding a rare or epic reward crate. Okay. Cool, I guess. Ah, this fucker. We just, we just saw him. He's whatever. Um, sent defense for staggers. That's about it, huh? Alright, well, good, good info. Oh, there we go. No immunities. Uh, no elite, no weakness. Oh boy. Alright. Okay. Looks like we've got a few different factions to deal with. Menku, Dagon, and Narosh. And then the, the big bad, the Overseer, which we know is our Protag's mom, right? Like, that's what the, the opening cutscene was all about. It's like, oh shit. Uh, how are we gonna fight and win and whatever, but yeah, okay, I get it. Well, it's one of the Imperium, maybe the next, they must have already started their attack. Alright, let's just turn you on. Alright. Who? Who and or what? Alright, yeah, turn it on. Uh, this fight is no more after all. Uh, pretty good job. You look like a run of the mill servo bot. Handy. Now. J5T1N. Boy, that name really rolls off the tongue. Uh, we have to go outside. I'll let you lead the way. Okay. He does look like a normal ass floaty robot. Counts for normal ass floaty robots in this universe. Again. Oh, sh sh jumps us forward. Nice. All right. Buildings, buildings usually aren't on fire. Usually, that implies that sometimes they are. Uh. Next, we'll be back soon to finish the job. Hurry, the entry point is right over there. Yeah, I know it's over there, but you know we might. Be, uh, might be some secrets. Let's look around for some secrets first. Not like this fire actually hurts it. Damn. They don't let you have any fun. I want you to go to the marked spot on the map. That's it. I guess occasionally you get points of interest that's like flavor text. But... Alright, fine. Interact. I walk through this portal and deliver a very important message, huh? Professor Zurich. Alright. I feel a test is how geniuses are sometimes. Yeah, uh, okay. Glad we're covering for geniuses here. 
<clears throat> I didn't play the message I gave you. Can you do that? Uh, sure, I guess. No slides, it's depend on you doing that. No pressure. Try not to let that give you a big header. There. Yeah. I'll through the portal when you're ready. Okay. Don't worry about me. This is the only thing that matters anymore. Okay, well, I'm not ready yet. Let's look around a bit. Surely we're not time limited. We aren't time limited. If we were, I'm sure I'd be no good at this game. <laughs> Alright, fine. There's nothing else of interest around here. Get out of here. Let's hope this were oh surely everything good comes of being cut off mid-word. Ah, uh, oh, uh, he's hoping he can't. <laughs> Ah, crap. Da crap. Oh, now we're back to here. Oh, there, there, there we are. Okay. Well, Davian's dead. This is his, like, memorial service, it looks like. Um. Oh, shit. He... This guy has seen some shit. Holy hell, look at him. Missing a fucking arm. Both of his eyes are probably cyborg eyes. He's smoking a, a, a cyber cigar there. <laughs> this guy. I hope this guy joins our party. Fucking love him. Alright, international invasions, whatever. I'll blow over. Meantime, relaxing my deeply buried bunker. You know, that's what I would do probably too. International invasion talk. Okay, this is all the flavor text. It's not important. Thing, really. Thing, those signals we caught were last night were introduction, blah blah blah. blah. Uh, so, it's in front of it's all over before Life Day. You know what? You probably shouldn't name a holiday or any day for that matter Life Day. Seems like you're asking for trouble. Uh, so there's much going on this way through the non existent space whales. Uh huh. And it's bottom thing, okay. Yeah, I see. Like, nobody cares that this this floating robot thing apparently has a mind of its own. Um, yeah, I probably got a message to deliver. No? Oh, not to, not to the protag or this named dude that just got introduced. But over to this building, I guess. Uh, the council plans to do with these readers, the ones that destroy the iron, kill the iron side effects. I don't know the joint chiefs, let me just say, we have a plan, oh boy. That is the first thing that somebody says who doesn't have a plan. Got a plan. My ass, you got a plan. We have all the armada stronger than ever, and we'll send that vessel back to the hell it came from. Well, I mean, that's not really a plan. That's a mission statement. And I don't really take kindly to mission statements. Oh, alright, yeah. Progress into the thing. What did I say about not being? Oh wait, this, this person looks familiar. Didn't we just leave you behind in the alternate dimension? Yeah, deliver the message, I guess. Most important, unexplainable quantum phenomenon in my career. So whatever it is, I hope it's reality. Chat. It kind of is. We uh, crossed realities to deliver this message, presumably. Yeah, hello, Doctor Zurich. It's it's me or you, Doctor Zurich. <laughs> Uh. Oh boy. I'm you and you're me. Yeah, okay, predictable. They're from different realities. I know this is highly confusing even to you slash me, right? Sent this hyper advanced servo bot. Yeah, hyper advanced, sure. Um, across the quantum divide to warn you. Reality, reality is under attack, even as you speak. Does it have anything to do with. Yes, it has everything to do with. It, oh, okay. The Q-71 entangled phenomenon, you took it over to Norris precisely. Certainly alerted the Star Union Council, and they dispatched the Armada to investigate. The Armada got its ass kicked, and, uh, and you see, you learn the Armada has been destroyed by a starship with unimaginable power cloaked in the entanglement. The ships from another reality. Blah, blah, blah. I know because they've already conquered mine. I mean, we saw in the opening cutscene that they fucking destroyed our Armada, right? I've got to warn them, it's far too late. Uh, wait, is this like an interactive hollow thing that we're projecting right now? I figured it was just like a one-way billabop. 
<clears throat> the council calls seeking a brilliant expertise in parallel realities. You'll need to have a plan ready. Hopefully it's better than the plan that uh, General Half Cyborg out there had. Uh, that's where I come in. I, I know these invaders' next move and how you can stop them. Follow my lead, your world is shot. If you fail, promise me you'll send uh, G5T1 in. The next reality they invade, they will never stop. Now listen up. Alright. First step is this. Reach out to General Gun and play him this message. You'll need to explain to- Why didn't we just play the message directly for the General? Uh, you need to explain it to him, but he'll help you form the kind of task force necessary to bring this invasion down. Okay. Oh. I... See. Uh, okay. We, I... Overworld? World maps? Okay. Ah, I see. Now we get pulled back for for the evil side of the information, right? If they are, I'm sure she had her reasons. Uh, blah, blah, blah. He is a trooper. He is, um... Presumably he. Uh, pretty low level. Looks like only 11 shield and 100 some... Well, almost 200 health and 2 armor. Wow. This guy won't be the first to die. That's for damn sure. Um, enraged and hit with concussion damage. Um, he's got 50% resistance against combo, he's not elite, and he's got a weakness to yeah, minus 50% defense versus crits. Yeah, this guy's gonna die. I mean, that's good to know, I suppose. We're probably gonna be fighting him soon, but... Oh, wait, are we him? Oh, that would be fun. That would be fun to play both sides of this also. <clears throat> All right, that engineer said the landing would be smooth. You know, honestly, considering that was probably an orbital drop, that looked like a pretty soft landing. Um, gone through worse landing. Eh, yeah, she's not wrong. Blah, 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 survived. It's a success in my book. Yep, yeah, right. Any landing you can walk away from, right? <clears throat> Have your companions with their pods. Seems they're having a little trouble with the hatches. Yeah, they didn't hit the open button. Is this like the, the ultra sci-fi equivalent of push versus pull, probably? Like idiot, you gotta you gotta pull on the door, not push. <laughs> Dumbasses. Uh. Well, it, it's good old Zerxnerza. <laughs> uh, boy. Oh no, that one's gonna die. Uh, Titans be praised, etc., etc. I get it. Look, you're not gonna try to convert me again, are you? Uh, who knows? Okay. <laughs> Look at this budget Han Solo motherfucker here. What the hell? Couldn't afford uh, Harrison Ford, huh? Oh man, okay. I I'm gonna probably not care what happens to him. Oh boy. Yeah, why don't you do that? <laughs> oh boy. Kill anything that slows you down. Okay, I'm liking the general more and more. Uh, one of their elite officers will be stationed at the base and you'll have to go through. Wait, if that's the elite officer we were just scoping out before, that guy is toast. Like, he's not, he's not even gonna be a fucking speed bump there. I only kind of by mission specs along the way, I'll lock and load and a tag and bag. Alright. Got it. Yeah, you know, these fundamentalists aren't big on sarcasm. Yeah, and and you're not big on class, I can see, so whatever. <clears throat> a radical form of honest discourse. You know, we could all use more radical, honest discourse in our lives, I think. Um, <clears throat> uh, what? Oh, what the? I, yeah, I, I didn't read that entire exchange. I'm sure it's fine. No, let's walk backwards. Maybe there's a point of interest back here. Oh. Oh, we can go, uh, fight a thing. Oh, right, we can scope shit out before we go. Oh. <laughs> yeah, let's go to the DNA vet. Get ourselves some DNA. Uh, uh, probably should do that, right? Food dispenser. Another DNA vet. It's like some low-level shitheads. 
Oh yeah, here's here's the dude here. <laughs> Perpetually near retirement. Oh no. Are we gonna ruin his retirement? I think we're gonna ruin his retirement. But alright, okay. I guess it doesn't matter what we do or where we go. So let's just go do and thing. Um Let me see like oh here, these squad X. So obviously us, the pro tag, right? Um and then random spiritual cyborg thing and then fucking trope ass space scoundrel I guess um oh I see so the DNA is probably like upgrade bits huh okay oh well, we should probably get as much of that as we can oh but we can't go back why can't we go back like it's clearly open oh, whatever all right get get some food um, is this the fire burning in for 12? Two combats, dust used. Okay, consumables. You can just say it's a consumable. Alright, so I guess there was a, a choice in paths, and we chose this path. Alright, get some DNA. Oh, three. Yeah. Ah. And then we go fight this single level one drone. Sure, this will be a problem. Oh, okay, never mind. There's another thing with it. Hmm, I see. Okay, well. Inspect before we do a thing, right? Uh, grounded when stunned. Okay, it's flying. And then that one has no weaknesses or strengths, I guess. Okay. They do seem to be pretty weak. 31, 63, 70, 25. Shield bot, huh? Well, we'll see about that. Okay, normal attack. Okay, that's gonna boink that dude back by 20, yeah? Or both of them will get boinked back, won't they? Alright, well, can we, uh. Oh, see, oh, I see. We can go back. Once we choose a, an attack or an action, we can go back before it executes. That's nice. Um. Oh, and I get to pick who we're picking to go here. Alright, you know what? I'm into that. Alright, let's boink that guy back in the timeline a little bit. Uh, okay, this is like our support unit, I guess. That's 50, uh, 50 additional shield and gets rid of dot effects. Nice, alright. But since nobody's really hurt or anything, we may as well just fucking... Oh, it's AoE too, so we're boinking both of them. I'm into that. And straight shot, blitz, it's light, it's speedy, but we don't really care about speedy, do we? Alright, you know what? Let's focus down on that fucker. And then, bam. Shields are gone. And then, nice. Okay, the next strike there, it's fine. Oh, hey, excuse me. Hmm, that's no good. Ah, oh, I see. It's gonna slam some shields on our buddy over there. Well, we're not gonna let that happen. We're gonna fuck him up before, uh, before that happens. Um, well, we're gonna try to fuck him up before that happens. Okay, well that'll be most of the stuff, right? So we can do that, and then be like, oh yeah, fuck you, kill shot. Um, and then we're going to get shields back on our friendly here. So, but Sam, get that idiot, and then Kaslash, that fucker's toast. And then, whoop, get some shields back here. Yeah, you, you powered up the shields of nothing, you dipshit. Way to go. Alright, now we're ready to just fuck this guy straight up. Um, can we maybe push him back? There we go. 
push him back even further, and then... Kabim boom bam There we go. There we go. And then one more. Kaboom boom bam boom. Shit. Blast in the next week. Oh, and toast, too. Excellent. Good fight. And all our shields recharge. Kill these guys, we can all go home. Probably. Yeah, very confident there, buddy. Um, uh, alright. I wonder what this giant gun symbolizes. Oh, uh, maybe just a giant gun. Actually, now that we have DNA, can we, yeah, leveled up. Obtain enough DNA, you can use it to level up your heroes. Those are reset when you return to the- oh. Levels are reset when you return to the Renegade base and jump to the next destination. That's interesting. Really? Increase health damage and possibly grant a new power or camping card. Uh, new powers or cards displayed in the Heroes Details panel. Okay. How much do we got? We got 11, so we can do two, two levels up here. More health. And we get a Battle Cry. Titan Strength. You know what? We're gonna do both of these. You know what? Fuck. Let's do... Oh, wait. Hold on a second. Reaction does not end turn. Taunts the enemy. Nice. Okay. But then it costs like 20 seconds for her. Incoming action, probably. That's what, if I'm reading that right. Uh, free action, then in turn, increase damage. Attack any position. I see. Okay, well, I definitely want it, right? Does it matter? I'm confused as to what I'm doing here. Oh, I oh I see. That was just to view info on the on the person. <laughs> Level up is X. There we go. Duh. And we'll level up our protag, because of course. Alright. Cool. Into it. Oh, and then here we've got our our Batul with the, the the dipshit commanding officer here, the lieutenant who is gonna get his day wrecked <laughs> because we're about to wreck it. But hey, whatever. I mean, he's got his back turned. We could probably just go quickly stab him. Ah, oh, never mind. <clears throat> Oh, they got to attack first. Boo! <laughs> no man bot thing behind. Okay. Alright. That's how we're gonna play it, huh? Why can't I use it, though? Oh, wait, uh, we need 20 Fury to use it. That's what the deal is. I get it. Okay. Um, alright. Uh, well, let's see what we got here. Uh... Weak versus crits. Doesn't like concussion damage. Uh... Resistant to combos. Got low health. And whatever. Um... Then there's this guy. Uh, which is no, no weaknesses, no nothing, but he's being covered by other dipshit over here. That's fine. Um... Okay. We're gonna move him into next week, I guess. Then... Actually, wait. Can we go back? Uh, let's cancel that. Let's see what this is actually gonna tell us. Oh, I see, yeah. Okay, so... Dummy there is gonna act first, but then we're gonna... Act on that guy, I guess. And then... What is he weak to? Anything? Crits. Okay, so he's gonna get crit the next week. 
probably. And then, uh, an AoE discharge on this fucker, huh? Which, that might, yeah, that's gonna trigger a defensive shot, but not too much, it looks like. Oh, it's AoE, so it's targeting both. Anyways, yeah, fuck it. Whatever. Let's go. Zerp. Counter to hit on something, but his shields are already toast, so he's gonna get blasted here. Armor's toast, and then he's probably gonna die here. No? Okay, that's fine, though. Zerp. Okay. Uh... Okay, they're gonna target my most forward ally there, huh? So we may as well regen some shields. It's not gonna be much. So move that guy back in the queue, yeah. So it's gonna be 25, plus a little bit of bonus, and he's gonna be bopped back. Oh man, he's almost gonna be dead, but not quite, huh? But that should be the kill shot, then, based on our sequence of events here, so yeah, let's do that. So one, kabim boom bam, eat shit. Um, recharge our, our front facing person there. Oh, jeez, excuse me. Uh, shields are down again, that's fine, but toast. Alright. Um, now... <laughs> Can we do the restore shields again? 60 shields seems like a good idea. Um, we'll have our dude bump this guy back a little bit, and then still be able to do this, right? He's not weak against uh, that, but it is a stronger attack, it looks like. Yeah, so fuck you. <laughs> Boom, bam, boom. Wow, nice. <laughs> oh, he's toast anyways. I didn't see I didn't see the kill shot on that either, but hey, we got him. <clears throat> we got a camping card. I guess we haven't done a camp yet, so we'll probably be tutorialized on that later. Yeah, he's toast. Fuck you. All right. Spoils of our victory. Pass some gear. Oh, we get to see what we're doing here. Um, cool. I do like burning effects, and I do like lasers. Um, burning is blocked by shields. Irradiated is blocked by shields and armor. Penetrates armor. 25%, right? It's burning. Uh, uh, I like that one. Yeah. Uh, equip that. Oh, it can only be equipped by our, our robo dude, though. Damn. Uh, I'm sure, I guess. Yeah. Equip. <laughs> Feel free to steal everything you can. Hell yeah. We're gonna steal everything. <laughs> the actual Imperium soldiers are monumentally stupid. Uh, cross quantum journey takes a toll on brain functions. Explain why they're networked into advanced AI neural net. Well, that also explains a few things, doesn't it? Okay. Uh, so we're facing an army of mindless, psychotic drone soldiers. Ah, <laughs> uh, I see. Also, we've got enough DNA for for levels again, huh? Ten DNA. Attacks cause bleeding, crit damage, last two combats. Oh, that's not... What do you mean, last two combats? Is 
But it is our, our main pro tag, so yeah, give me. More health. More health and a card, whatever that means. Actually, wait. Uh, it's cards? Oh no, that's just the, what we've done here. Um, let me look at that again. I don't know what card. Oh, there. So I guess if we use it, how do we use it though? It's something I can. Well, I mean, it doesn't make sense to use it now since we're done with this area. I guess we would have gotten a different equipment thing down there. Well, maybe it's for the best they block off uh, paths once you use them. So I'd be, I'd totally be the one to be like, all right, we're gonna fucking loot the hell out of this area, even if it takes forever. Uh, yeah, it's nice and nice as bogies. Yeah, we sure did. Nice long as you've earned a break. Hell yeah. Can't get some rest, we'll push on in the morning. Camming allows your heroes to rest and gain affection for each other. Ah, uh, really? It's the own set of camping cards that they can play on themselves or other heroes and cost action points and can grant special status effects, regenerate lost health, repair armor, increase affection. Uh, share between all heroes and cards can vary in their action point costs. If you've used up all your action points, your squad will go to sleep. I see. And affection, and strength, the relationship, and unlock conversations and bonuses, beneficial traits, combo powers, sometimes even new progeny heroes. Oh, okay. You can just say that they'll fuck. You just tell me they're gonna fuck and produce an offspring. Like, you don't need to couch it in softball terms. <laughs> Alright, um... Okay, so we've got five action points. We can use all of these if we want to. Um... What, is, what does that mean? I guess that just improves... Relationship by three hearts. And this improves relationship by five hearts. Um, oh, I see. I mean, everybody's got their, their little, their different things here. Uh, attack range 10 shield, attack range shields, last two combats, two fights, right? Interesting, huh? I do like attacks causing bleeding, though. Uh, let's do it. Does that apply to everybody? Or just me? Oh, I see. We get to pick who it applies to. Uh... I mean... Like... Spiritual robot dude over here doesn't do a lot of attack. He does a lot of shield regens, right? So let's... Against my better judgment, let's make friends with the, the budget space scoundrel over here. Um, got four action points left. Okay. Attack uh, strain, ten shields. Sure. Yeah, there. And, uh... 30, plus 30 max sheets. Okay, but for two combats only. Eh, yeah, well, alright. And that's it. We're out of action points, so I guess we go to sleep. Relationship status. What do we got here? Oh, wow. Okay. I was going by the heart icons, not by like six out of a hundred. My goodness. These relationships take time. Okay. Um, we're good. Let's go to sleep now. They'll have zero points available. If you leave now, they'll be lost. Oh no, not my zero points! <laughs> I'm sure that'll be more important to, like, be careful with what we're doing there, but... For now, when we're still probably tutorial mode here, it's fine. Um, oh boy, more robots, though. 
commander. He's a bigger fucker. 146 shields, 401 health. Uh, doesn't like counters, apparently. Strong against counters, but he hates counters. Um, he's also resistant to staggers, but he's weak to Phasma less shield. Oh, he's weak to Phasma, and then separately, they could have used the divider there. He's got less shields. Okay. And then there's this one, another big-ass robot thing. Nothing special, but lots of shields, lots of health, that could be a problem. Slightly smaller idiot here. Uh, very few shields. A little bit of health, though. Uh, strong against armor damage and fire. Oh, good. Glad we grabbed that fire thing. Uh, uh, but also weak to Phasma. I don't know what the fuck Phasma is. I guess it's an element of some description, right? And there's this last big fucker here. Uh, strong against normal attacks. Uh, weak against combos and heavies. Alright, good to know. Oh boy, a mission update. What do we got? Only open small temporary dimensional gates. They found a way around the constraint by using Titan Core and Ancient Ore buried in the ground. The structure of these cores is a high degree of quantum stability. Okay, yeah. Good MacGuffin there. If they manage to get a hold of this energy source, they'll be able to open a full dimensional gate. Alright, so don't let them... Don't let them do that, is what I'm catching here. Uh, let's make sure they never get that Titan Core. Yeah, okay, way ahead of you there, Win. They appear in a behemoth to remove the Titan Core in three days. <clears throat> if you stop them here, we can thwart their invasion plan. I've covered the areas of the force fields, hoping to slow you down. Blah, 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 heck, systems. Uh, this is a new quantum feedback device, blah, 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 blah. Um, only have for three barrier breaches. There we go. You just tell me that. Uh, before you need to recharge for the night. So keep full sign your time and resources. Okay. Three barriers, you say. Um, uh, okay, so now this is a longer encounter slash thing, right? You have a limited amount of days to reach a landing zone intercepted before the planet is destroyed. Oh, it's rough. Uh, this path lies a landing zone, might find an objective marker. If you run out of time, you'll be automatically transported to face the behemoth. If you reach the objective area early, you can use the terminal there to reopen lockdown areas or use the tent to make an early camp. And a number of packing charges, yeah, we just figured that out. Uh, Imperium emblem on this, they're about to be locked down, and if you don't reclaim it before the day is over, then it will no longer be accessible. Okay. Okay, so we've got three days, or nine barrier unlocks things, I guess. And they're essentially telling me, hey, go to the marked places first. Um, so they, they don't become inaccessible, right? That's the deal? Uh, let's see, okay. Station. Rare items and shit. Various low level dipshits, and then higher level dipshits. Okay. Well, I feel like we should go to the very first one that's about to be locked down and be like, hey, no, man, fuck you. You don't get to lock that down, we get to not lock it down. Ah, uh, okay, three on three. Fair fight. Um... Okay, AoE seems good. That's gonna bot them all back and bunch them all up. Also, pierces shield, or pierces armor, right? And also does burning. But I don't... Yeah, it's blocked by shields, though, so that's a no-go for now. Blitz do. This is defense and causes bleeding. Actually, let's inspect these dudes first. Uh, okay, so, you know, basic bitches, robo-soldiers mark ones, right? And then this guy. Grounded when stunned, and then these dudes got nothing special to him. All right, uh...
Alright, let's do this immediately, right? AoE, get them all bunched up. Um, probably push that guy back even further. Oh, but it moved somebody else up. That's interesting. If I'm reading that right, I guess. Oh, maybe not. Okay, well, let's target that guy. And then... Whoever we hit is going to be blasted back anywhere anyways, right? I don't know, are we? Okay. Who am I all targeting here? Is this my, is my dude targeting there? Wait, what? Why was there... Why did it seem like there was a... Alright, hold on a second. Let me do this. That first, and then... Blast that guy back. There was some other thing going on there. I'm getting, like, some sort of assist bonus there, I guess? I don't know. It's hard to fucking tell. But alright, that'll murder that guy just straight up out of here. I'm into that. Let's do that. Bim boom bam. Bim boom bam. His shields are toast. And then... A slash boom bam. He's fucking dead, right? Yeah, nice. Alright, I'm into it. Alright, and then 40 shields down, whatever, we're fine. They ain't gonna do shit. Um, what's our auto fire? What's their auto fire doing? Oh, 41. 20 and maybe some armor damage, I guess. So how many shields? I got 50 shields left. And they're gonna do a bunch of stuff. So, uh, well, that would be prime to be like, hey man, let's give you some shields back, huh? And then we can be like, all right, let's make sure that one of these fuckers has a bad time. Like that guy. And then we can be like, all right, then this other fucker is going to die. Preferably before he gets to act. And honestly, if that's the case, I don't need to worry about the shield so much, do I? Eh, eh. All right, fuck it. One at a time. Hey, I'm go up and how you doing? Good to see ya. Yeah, we're doing a little turn based stuff. A little story, a little turn based, you know. Getting our adventure on, our sci fi adventure. Our sci fi, presumably, sort of time travel y adventure so far is what we've been able to glean out of it. Alright, so that guy's gonna fucking die and we'll give this guy the kill. No, he's not gonna get the kill. Give this guy the kill, and then we'll just be like, ah, oh, yeah, fuck it. Zzz. Make sure he's super dead. <laughs> oh, and he's on fire, too. If you're gonna die, you're gonna die burning. Zzz. Excellent. Then we get all our shields back, and we get some DNA. Yeah, that was a good fight. Get some money. Future credits. So wait, can we then... Then we can go back and go get that one too, huh? Which, you know, might be alright. Might be an okay idea. Get all the shit. Before it gets locked down, I mean, really, we've got three days to fuck around, right? Oh, this one's about to be locked down too. But, at the same time, it's just like, well, we've got one, we've got two, that'll be three total barrier things, right? Should be able to get over to this one before it's a problem. And I guess all these other ones without barriers on them are kind of just like, yeah, whatever. Actually, are all these marked? No, I guess not, because some of these could be locked down without them telling us about it, right? So if we go back here, take that one down, we go down here, 
I imagine this one's also gonna be like, hey, you gotta spend a barrier charge to blah blah blah, and be like, alright, that's the end of the day, good job. Um, doesn't hurt to go look, right? Yeah, see, look at that, fucker. But I do kind of want that DNA, and I want to put this shithead in the ground too, so let's go. Oh, we get to fight on a bridge though, that's fun. Uh, alright, what's your deal, man? He's got nothing special. Okay. Um, but he's got 52. 52 outgoing damage there, he's going my, against my front runner. Um, alright. 50% damage does not end the turn. Free action. Do it. Hell yeah. Takes effect immediately. Everybody's super inspired. Okay. What else can we do? We can move that guy back 10 seconds or 15 seconds or 45 seconds even. Reduces defense. And causes bleeding. I don't know how we're gonna bleed a, a, a robot. I guess there's still kind of a fleshy dude wrapped in robot parts in the middle there. Maybe that's what's gonna be bleeding. Move him into next week. Oh, he's just gonna fucking do it right now. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Alright, that's an immediate fucking just do it. I I get it. Okay. Um, and then we can just do, I don't know. Blocked by shields. Oh, all right. Oh, well, either way, doesn't matter. Do that, and then we can do the heavy hit. They're both gonna be crits anyway, so there we go. Bim, boom, bam, and then kaboom, bam, boom, bam. Ooh, damn. Sick. Shields are toast. Let out a little bit. Uh. Okay, he's not gonna be... Okay, we can't... Can we not blast him back anymore? Did we empty his... What is it? The, the break... The break limit meter or whatever the fuck it is? Yeah, he's not moving back anymore, is he? But alright, he's got... How much has he got left? 154. Can we, uh... Total this fucker before he... Even gets to do a thing? So we're gonna do like 40-ish damage there. We're gonna do about a 50 there. That's 90, and he's got 60 left. I don't think we're gonna do this in one, but there's no way he's gonna do any particular damage to us anymore, so... May as well just full-on attack this fucko. Oh, and then now he's burning too, so maybe that'll help too. Boom, boom, bam. And then Slash, okay. He's gonna be burning and bleeding, and oh. Oh, shit, that's a lot of shield damage. I don't think it matters. Like, he's about to be toast anyway. Who am I gonna give the kill to? Who gets to go first here? Okay, that's not gonna be a kill shot, but it's gonna be fun. It'll be up to these two, really. Who gets the kill? Oh, I think our protein gets the kill here. Excellent. Good. <laughs> And we get some DNA out the out the thing too. Gross. All oh, right. When they're all easy as rush for the night, you freely explore the areas. You reclaim to interact with people or side missions, and you're ready. You can camp to end your day. Okay. But I kind of figured. Well, I want the DNA for sure. Oh, we got a little extra DNA out of that, and then we get that, which is super fucking cool. Um. Let's level up. Who gets to level up? Oh, not our main protag, though. We already leveled her up twice. Um... Oh, I see. So each level up. That's what the cards are. The cards are little camping bits, huh? Oh, plus he gets an extra little... Uh... Uh, uh like, a little action thing. Uh, a little ability. Alright. Do I care about this right now? I probably don't. Let's, let's look around a bit. So now we can easily go back and just investimact things, huh? Look for secrets. There are no secrets here. Ooh. 
Okay, so each like little tiny area transition here is gonna be locked down, right? So we gotta keep that in mind when we do our thing. And we've got two more days to get up to that one, so let's see. One, two, three, and then one, two, and then we're up there, I guess. So we're still kind of set up for uh, for success here. Oh, kind of missed this there. Rare shit over there. I didn't get it. It's fine. Okay, we might be able to do that one. Do one, two, three to get over here. It's gonna be a lot of fights. And then one. Uh. Use the armor thing. Two, and then we've got kind of that. Or we can do uh, one, two, go up, fight this fucker, get some equipment, get some epic equipment, and then also three, and do the objective. That seems like the plan. Alright. Uh, is that what I was thinking of, friend? One, two, three, one, two, Three. Yeah, okay. And do it. Seems ill advised to camp out on a bridge. I mean, you've kind of put yourself open to attack from two sides and you've really got nowhere else to escape from. But what the fuck do I know? Um. Oh, interesting. So I thought these were consumed. I guess we get to use them again? Oh, unless it says exhaust when used, I guess, huh? So that one we get to use whenever in a, in a camping bit. This one goes away, this one goes away, this one persists. I get it, I get it, I get it. Okay, uh, kinda into that then. Uh, text range shields, I like that. Use that with our attackers, right? Be like, hey, yeah. Fucking give me that. And then, uh, we'll return the favor and be like, hey, yeah, you can now do bleeding. <laughs> Some of this neurobrew. What the fuck's a neurobrew? That sounds weird and sci fi. Kinda into it. <laughs> Uh. Yeah, where'd she grow up? Uh, mansion on Fabuloso. That's a that's a made up place. <laughs> a crumbling mansion. Okay, yeah, disrepair. Oh, we did it. We 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 unlocked a a hey, we're friends but just barely bit here. I guess. Companions, oh goody. Uh, 20 more health is good. Uh, 5 second stagger and all attacks is good. I like that. It's beneficial, at least, right? And we've got two bits left. Uh, here. Let's use this one on... More shields, huh? Who is, uh... Hold on a second. Can I look? Oh, there we go. Who's got the least shields? Our, our little, like, budget-ass Han Solo's got the least number of shields here. But he's also been taking, like, fewer attacks than anybody else. Because our pro tag is, like, front line. So fuck it. Let's give her more shields. Alright, and we're done. Well, don't leave those zero points on the table, though. We're fine. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Two days until the behemoth. Yeah, we know. <laughs> we fucking know. All right, but as soon as we go down here, we're gonna take some damage. Um, so let's just count this out, just to be sure. One, two, three. We're gonna fight that fucker probably. We're gonna get some equips. Um, and then we'll end up here, right? So and then one, 
Uh, two, we're gonna get the epic loot up here, and then three, we're gonna get to the objective before the end of the third day, right? Excellent. That seems like a good idea. That's a good plan. See, now that's a plan. Like, a plan isn't, like, rebuild the Ar armada, make the enemy pay. That's not a plan. This is a plan. Okay, uh, let, let's go. And we're gonna take some damage? 15 damage? What does that mean? Does 15 damage to shields? If that's the case, I don't fucking care. Yeah, we're, we're fine. Um, oh, we can do, like, hell yeah, let's fucking get inspired. We might, should probably leave that until the, the bigger battle, though, huh? Okay, what's this fucker's deal, though? Um, he is, uh, nothing special. I mean, he's got some shields, got 97 shields and some health. Um, but other than that, he's kind of pretty basic bitch standard, right? Uh, okay. Okay, well, that'll break him into next week. I like that. And it reduces defense for one turn, one round, I guess. That takes effect immediately. Well, so we'll think about that. Um, we also have this. Hell is Titan Strength. Can I see what that is? Uh, uh. Oh, I can't, like, go look at that now. Yeah, but what's that? Oh, there. Uh, attack any position and plus 50% damage. Damn, that's fucking sick as hell. Um, we'll, we'll, we'll wait, though. We've only got 20 fear. <clears throat> okay, uh, so first, blast that fucko into next week. There we go. Good job. So, pretty much free actions now. Um, heavy ass action here. And then, I mean, let's do this. It's gonna be blocked by shield, so it's not gonna burn him, but it'll do a little bit of something, something. And then, kaboom, bam, boom, bam. Damn, nice. 64. Shields are fucking wasted there. And now we've got. Okay, so now. Oh, I see the little zero in the diamond up on his little icon. I don't know why I'm pointing, it's not like you can see that. But the little zero in the diamond up by the enemy's icon there says, like, no, you can't fucking push him back any further. But I get it. Alright, you know what? They, they do a pretty good job of conveying this stuff. Because chances are, in two days when I come back to this game, I'm gonna be like, what the fuck does this mean? And I'll just have to remember and or just read the screen. Um, okay, so what can we do here? It's this will cause burning, right? And what is he what is he about to do? Laser eyes, which is pretty much just shield damage. Which is literally no downsides, because he's gonna get fucking wasted probably this turn. So alright, I'll just do that. And I'm gonna wait. I'm just gonna do the quicker one, right? And then this This guy's just gonna Unleash, right? Yeah, there we go. Bim boom bam, 14 plus burning. And then bim boom bam, 48, it's pretty sick. And then boom, another 43. And he's still bleeding again and or whatever. And then berserp zap zerp, 39 shield is nothing. All right, who's getting the, uh, who's getting the kill here? I mean, hell, I could do the heavy attack just to just to make sure. No kill like overkill, right? Um, that c okay, man, he's he's so fucking weak. Our our little tiny piss ass twelve damage attack is gonna do uh do the kill here. So everybody gets a chance. Who's gonna take the kill? There you go. Good job. Oh no, our our budget Han Solo gets the kill. Never mind. We get 20 monies and a mushroom. Uh, 
Uh, okay, flavor text, got it, and then we get this. 25% health! Um, which we don't... haven't needed to use, really, because we haven't taken any damages. Um, alright. Let's, uh... There we go. Uh, alright, we got two left, right? So one, two over to this fucker, right? And then one, two... Just gonna double check. I'm paranoid that I'm gonna fuck up. Right? So we'll get the, the cool stuff and get to the objective within the allotted time. I don't care to go fight that fucker. Low level bitch, not worth my time. Alright, let's go do this. Let's go fight this guy. Oh, oh no, Th three grunts, three uh, whatever Mark 1s, right? Tro oh, trooper. Oh, they're troopers. Oh, and there's a named trooper. Oh, he is slightly... He's got 11 more health. Wow. What a pro. Alright. Let's see what we can do about this, huh? Oh, we've got an AoE. I'll push them back, mostly. Okay. And I could push one of them, like, super back into next week here. What do they even have? Like, they've got, oh, it's just health. They don't even have shields. Like, we're just gonna straight up murder them. Okay. I mean, I don't mind breaking one of these fuckers. Like that one. Wish we had an AoE attack for... Or other people here as well, but yeah, we may as well. Okay, actually, wait, hold on a second. We're gonna re retool this a bit. AoE, of course, right? Um, but then we should focus down. Uh, where's the frontline dude? There's the frontline dude, right? Okay, so they're all back there, and then we are able to do probably a kill shot on this fucker. There we go. Make it two on three instead of three on three. Oh, they're all fucking burning too. Great. <laughs> totally forgot I had a burning bit. All right, there we go. Kaboom, bam, boom. Another notch on the belt. 35 is pretty strong, I guess. 39 is, you know, less strong. And now they're burning, and now we get to be like, yeah, fuck off. Um, so we just do that, so they get both bopped back to the next bit there. Alright, well, let's do the AoE attack, of course, and it looks like our front runner is gonna be fine on shield. Either way, these fuckos are gonna be broken, and then to get a kill shot on this guy, so fuck you. And they're only gonna burn again, right, okay. Okay, so maybe like the, the burning bit was a good choice. Alright, there goes that fucker. And 23 shield, oh no, I think we'll survive. Um, Alright, and then, you know what? Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna be like, yeah, fuck you, you're gonna get pushed back. And then you're gonna get pushed back even further, and then we get to be like, fuck you. Get the kill shot there. There we go. Potent. Fucking potent as hell, and we get four more DNA, which means we could probably upgrade somebody, yeah? It's, uh... Okay, got 19, so another 30 health for our pro tag, right? Or, we could try to balance out the levels with everybody else as well. Could do that. Don't know if I want it, though. <laughs> you know what, fine, let's do it. Balance is good. Balance is good.
Um, and we could get some more shields. Or we could do this fight first and then get some more shields. What is this? Is this fucker a problem? Is he gonna be a problem? This lad's a level two. He's a level two and he's got a flamethrower, but that's about it. I imagine with our crew of three, we could probably be fine against him. Let's do it. Oh, he's got an extra bit with him, too. Oops. Eh, I'm sure we're fine. Okay, so, uh... Oh, he's gonna take an armor, an armor hit and a health hit there. Unless we, uh, break Big Boy back there, huh? Oh. Uh... Wait, what? Oh, he's doing a fucking AoE attack. Oh, I don't like that. Well, we need to break him then before he, uh... Before he does that. Alright. Easy enough. Uh... Stun? Stun is interesting. Okay, that probably wipes him completely off the current turn, doesn't it? Only executed once per combat, though. But we do have a lot of, uh... of fury. So let's go ahead and do, like, hey... Uh... Let's give, uh, you know, let's, uh, oh, it only, it only, only plus 50% damage on a single target. Okay. What about this one? Does this matter? Oh, only 50% damage to a single ally. Ah, I see. Okay. Now let's do this one then. Um, and we'll focus on the big boy. Um, and then we can do our things here. So, bzzz, bzzz, bzzz. Um, that guy gets pushed back a little bit. We can break that guy into next week. Guess. Who is this guy gonna target, actually? I'm gonna target the back one. Alright, that's probably fine then. So let's make sure this guy gets broken before he gets to attack, right? And then. Do a heavy attack on. Wait, what's that other? Wait, that guy's gonna. No, he's gonna be broken. Why am I? Oh, that's the little icon below the little headshots are who they're attacking. I get it. Never mind. A little trouble interpreting that at first. Okay, uh, but he resists. This is Pyro, huh? Resists burning, uh, weak against Phasma, whatever. And Rage on Guard is broken? I don't know what that means. 50% uh, resistance to armor damage, but he's got low health, supposedly. Okay, well, we can fucking do a heavy attack against him. I'm sure it'll be fine. Boom, boom, bam, boom, bam. Alright. Shields are gone. Broken into next turn. That guy's gonna take a hit, whatever. We knew that was gonna happen, and then boom bam boom bam. Okay, they're gonna do a mm. Looks like they're gonna be doing a group attack regardless, huh? Which uh is gonna be a Problem, actually. Uh, okay. I... Oh, I can't... Buff myself, huh? That's a problem. <clears throat> Yeesh, that's... A big problem. Uh, okay. Alternatively, I could be like, hey, you know what? Fuck you. I'm gonna take you off the timeline. No matter what. I 
if I was reading that correctly. Yep, so he's stunned, so he's no longer going to do a thing. Good, good read. Um, and then we do that. He gets pushed back. And then we murder this fucker just entirely, right? Seems good. Bim boom bam, good kill. Now it's just this idiot. Which, uh, how much does he have left? 264, that's a lot of health. Um, it looks like we're only gonna be taking one armor damage. Unless, we'd be like, hey, you know what? No, you don't get to do that. So, beef up your shields. Uh, straight shot there, and we'll do the lightish lightish attack here. Nice. Okay, good. Then boom, bam. There, very good. And then beef up shields there. And he'll be like, yeah, whatever. And bye bye, sixty shields. Oh, and we still took. Uh, oh, ouch. Still took uh, full damage there. That's not good. Well, no matter. Um, I think this guy's toast on this turn anyway, so we'll break him back into. Uh, I cancel that. Let's see what this is gonna do first. Okay, that'll move him back. Just gonna repair shields there. Make sure he gets broken in the next turn and then do a nice heavy attack there. Are we still burning? Are we gonna take that? No. Okay, we're, we're still in pretty good shape. Uh, so then, it's not going to be pushed back any further, unfortunately. And who is he attacking? He's attacking that dude. We've got 42 shield, and he's about to do 42 damage. All right, well, well matched. Now I guess we just kind of get as many kill shots in here as we can. Oh, that goes against everybody. Well, there goes all of our shields. That's fine. I, this guy's gonna be toast anyways, right? Aw. Oh. No, you're fucking toast, buddy. Who gets the kill? Oh, our, our, our robo... spiritual robot dude gets the... Oh no, our protag gets killed. kill. Never mind. <laughs> Excellent. Whoop. All right. That guy ate shit. There's gonna be another one that eats shit here too. That guy's gonna escape. But let's get some equips. Oh, get some uh, fire S words or a laser gauntlet. You know what? I like, I, I like the fire S word. It's, uh, plus sixty percent armor damage, or an extra five seconds stagger. Uh, hmm. I like the extra stagger. I think. Yeah, let's do it. It's good shit. Plus now we can get some extra credits. Three buckos. Somebody's left on the ground there. We can look at this. And it's flavor text, pretty much. And some more pocket change laying around. Let's look around, I guess. At the 
time to do it. Make sure there's not any, like, extra buckos up here, right? No. Okay. Okay, and I think our initial plan is still well within reach here, right? We, uh... Go one there. Defeat this fucker here, no problems. Two, take on that fucko. And then three for this, right? And then that'll be good. Alright. Let's uh, camp out for the night. Uh, heal health 50%. We really don't need the. Okay, 25%. Resistance to pyro. But no health. Uh, no health stuff there, huh? Oh, here. Here's the 25% health heals. Like, how are we. Like, we're not in any danger of dying, really. We haven't really been up against a wall, so. We're probably fine. Um, green ten shields. Uh, let's do combat. Uh, sure. And then, um, tax cause bleeding, right? And crit damage up. Apparently, I, I didn't see that before. Uh, and then we've got two bits left. Which, presumably, these zero action point expenditures are nothing, right? Like, it's just like, yeah, whatever, just do it. Ah, if you can only use it, use it with one. Oh, I see, interesting. Okay, well, I mean, it's it's literally free? Is there any point to saving this for a rainy day? Probably not. Can we just, like, do it up? <laughs> just fucking use everything, can't take it with you type thing, right? Oh, I see. They were listed on both, both people. All right, and more max shields, which uh, honestly seems like a good idea, right? And then, okay, well, there's still one thing we can use. Twenty-five percent health. I mean, may as well, right? Let's get him back up to full and make sure he doesn't die. There. We're good. Alright. Dawn of the third day. 24 hours remains. <laughs> okay. Well, we're probably not going to care too much about this fight. This fight seems like really a non-issue. So let's just do it. Oh no, it's three dudes instead of two. Um, we're probably fine. Let's take a look here. Uh, ground and stunned, we knew about that. Nothing special there, nothing special there. All right. So, AoE, but Maul back and be like, hey. break that one entirely, I suppose, right? And then we may as well just finish it off. Alternatively, uh... Oh, that one takes forever, like, all time. I suppose I could just break two of them, and then... 
Yeah, let's do it this way. Okay, that one's broken out of there, and then this one should be broken into next week as well, and then only one gets to really act here. Which, yeah, whatever, 26 shields. Fucking no issue. Um, alright, and then in order to make sure we're doing this properly, just be like, hey, let's get this guy. Oh, that guy's just gonna eat shit immediately there, huh? I think... Yeah, oh wow, we're gonna get both of those, huh? And then... Get this guy just out of it entirely. So that's gonna do a stun that'll take him off the timeline, right? I read that icon correctly. Uh, and then the only, I guess the only problem here is that it's gonna be... Wait, wait. A little bit confused about what's gonna happen here because that one's well that guy's gonna die probably anyways this one's probably not gonna die but he's been stunned right so that's probably fine the way it is so bim boom bam right double kill all right that's what i was looking for and then we get to pretty much free action this fucker into into nothing <laughs> there we go perfect Okay. Into it. Good fight. Oh, and this isn't this isn't even blocked off to begin with, so we we get a like a, a an additional free action here. Oh shit! And plus we get additional armor. Uh, well our frontliner has been pretty under attack most of the time, right? We should maybe do a shield improvement here for the next battle. Uh, let's give our Tabatur 20 extra shields, I guess, right? Okay, so now if we do this, we get to go fight the quote-unquote like big bad here I, I want that equipment so I think we've got little choice in the matter really so let's do it I guess okay oh he's, he's, he's colored gold he's got two other basic bitches with him um, alright. This is a small issue if they're focusing down my pro tag here. Well, let's see. Um, uh, Laser Storm 90 is a problem. So we might want to get rid of that. Um, I need to hit with a counter. I don't have any counters, I don't think. Attacks are faster, and defense versus staggers. Really? Problem. Laser damage, pyro damage. Hmm. Okay. Well, alright. Oh, I didn't mean to actually execute that, though. Um... Okay, never mind. I guess that takes him off the timeline. It's fine. Oval we'll deal. Fucking deal. Alright, that'll bump them both back by 10, which I'm into. And then... Oh, that's a late attack. Oh, let's do this instead. Let's get that one. Alright, so now two of them are off. Mm, okay, but she had the shield boost on her already, so it's fine. 
Uh, the rest is gonna be a problem, though. Uh, it's not gonna be a kill shot. So with that, and then also that, not quite a kill shot, huh? Come on. And that's not gonna... Well, reduced defense, though, so that might be enough? Let's try it. And he bled out, kind of, right? So then now let's undo that and see what happens. Oh, it's not going to be enough for a kill shot. Unfortunate. But no real choice, I don't think. She's already attacking late. I don't like that. Attacking late, and she's gonna take a big hit. Maybe instead, then, I should do... a shield recharge here. Oof. Except that happens late, so she's gonna take the bop no matter what. I don't like that. that. Um, they're gonna get moved back a little bit, it looks like. And her defense takes effect immediately. Okay, it's fine. Oh, that's not gonna be fine, though. Ouch. Ah. <laughs> okay, that's fine. One's gone. She's still in relatively good health. Now we get the benefit of... Uh, maybe breaking this fucker off the face of the earth here. Alright, that's fine. Oh, uh, it's gonna go against our- jeez, that's a problem. Um... Is there no... Hey, there's no weaknesses. I guess this is the sort of the big bad, so if we go all out here, it's fine. Although, I'm... I'm forced to wonder if there's going to be, like, a, a story battle coming up here at the end of this, so... We'll kind of play it like that's going to be the thing. Ouch, 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 oof. Okay, that dude's still fucking standing, huh? Alright. There's the kill shot there, at least. Oh. It's looking rough, though. Okay, let's... Yeah, balls. Okay, can we... Delay that fucker enough? Lay those both back to there, and then shields. Okay, there we go. Mitigate the problem a little bit. So that guy should be toast, yeah. Alright, he's out of there, and then we get a shield recharge here. Plus 60, right? Well, plus 70 is even better. And, okay, that prevents more health damage at least. Now we're good to just beat the hell out of this guy. Really beat the hell out of this guy. 
Although I don't think that's going to be enough to let my big attack do the thing, right? Oh no, it will be. Okay. So, alright. Do that. And then... Okay, that guy's going to take a little bit of... A little bit of a problem, I think. That's alright. He's got some health. Um... there, and he's burning, I guess. Robots can burn. 97's a pretty big hit. Also burning. Then, alright, he's gonna take a little bit of 28 damage, whatever, it's fine. And now we just need to finish the job. Finish the job. Big hits. Big hits all the way around. Oh, no kill shot though, huh? Oh, if we get screwed out of the kill here. We'll see. Because at least one of these is going to do the burn, right? 50 is pretty strong, and then the big, the big attack should finish it, right? Yeah, nice. Please burn. Oh, boo! Fucking coward! He ran away! Ah, oh, what a shitter. Fucking shitter. I guess we still got, like, the... the loot. We still got the loot out of that battle, so whatever. It's fine. Um, okay. Particle Blaster. 19% damage, 18% armor damage. Or a different S-word for our Protag. Oh, no, I like our burning S-word. That's fine. Than just a normal ass thing that we can give to anybody, huh? 16% damage to heavy attacks. And then staggers do additional 15%, whatever. You know what? I'm kind of into that. Let's do it. Seems good. Alright, so we've got one more. One more thing we could do. Do I wanna? Or do I wanna just fucking get this done and over with? I think we just do that. I think we just do the. We just do the thing. Like, we do that, right? Bonk, whatever. I like it matters. We have got one barrier buster left. You know what? No, let's just do the objective. Get out of here. Forfeit your charges and camp early. I mean, what else am I going to do? Just go do another fight? I guess we could do another fight. Go fight that basic bitch up there. Wish we could get over to that heal a bit. I guess we could go all the way back around and get that heal a bit up at the like the north uh, western corner there huh be super safe about it I guess we are gonna be facing like an end area boss here so why not do it safely right Maybe the far-flung future, but there's no reason not to be cautious. Um, all right, shitheads. Let's uh, blast y'all back there. Take one out of the running entirely, more or less. Just get that one out of here. Now, either one of these, really. What are these fuckers gonna do? Not really anything. These dudes are not threatening. So why don't we take out... One of these dudes. Pick them off one by one. Dude, we're gonna get a kill immediately, right? Bonk, bing, bonk. Fuck you. 
these dudes get to go. Oh no, 26 shield. Oh no, minus whatever shield. Okay, now we just do this in the correct order and we're probably fine. Get rid of that, and then be like, oh yeah, you're dead. Um, but also then there's this. Which is gonna break that guy regardless, right? So he doesn't get to go this turn anyway, so we may as well just be like, yeah, fuck you, you don't get to go this turn either. to be like, yeah, you go the fuck away, and then we get to use the stun on this guy, just get him right out of there. That's the rest of his shields, right? More or less. And then we get to go like, yeah, fuck you, here's the kill shot, the, the, the big hit, right? extra DNA. Now we get some health and some extra money. Uh, full heal, huh? Does that heal everybody, everybody? Hell yeah, and now everybody's back to full. I love it. Good choice. It's a good choice. That was a good plan, I think. And before we do the actual final battle here, we've got a few things for level ups, don't we? Who gets to level up? 19 and 16, or 19 and 10, or 16 and 10? Okay, so we can do two levels. Um... I wish we gained shields and not just health, but that's fine, I guess. Alright, so let's give our Protag a level, and give our Budget Han Solo a level. Pretty balanced. Into it. And now we can go do the objective. And I suppose we'll, we'll have the, the big bad fight. We get to do this again. Okay. Um, bleeding and additional crit damage, right? I guess it doesn't matter at this point. Oh, we'll get a second companionship perk. I think. Or are we just like one short? No, here's the extra whatever. <clears throat> Oh, we get a combo! Oh, pretty good combo, actually. Stun, plus 91 damage, plus 68 damage. Oh, man, that's pretty good. And bleeding three. Excellent. Okay. I'm into it. Um, then a heal, which we don't really need. Shield defense is pretty good. But then attack drain shield, so that's give and take, I guess, right? And then... Uh, Armor piercing is pretty good, but also uh, max shield is pretty good too. So Yoinkaruski, plus we get a one companionship bonus here, I suppose. Uh, extra health, pretty good, and we regen shield. That's also pretty good. All right. Uh, any uh, zero bits to use? I guess just that one, but meh. Everything else seems fine. All right, we're good. Now we're ready to fight the big bad. <laughs> All 
As Behemoth is just waiting to blah 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 blah. Your only chance to stop it, fail, and the Imperial Invasion Fleet will be here by the end of the day. Yeah, we'll, we'll do it. We'll manage. We'll, we'll be able to do it, I think. We should be able to... Three on one. Three on one this fucker, right? Unless he's got some dummy idiots with him. No, he doesn't. Okay, three on one. Okay. <laughs> Let's see, so there's our, our big combo attack. Seems good. 91 plus whatever. Um, let's see what we're dealing with here, though. Oh, that's a hell of an attack. Um, 442 shield. That's a lot. Um, and no strengths or weaknesses, so it's pretty much just straight up damage. A damage race here. Um, we could also do... Battle Cry, which that just fifty percent damage for one turn, is that what it is? I don't know if I like that. What's the other one here? Fifty percent damage for one turn, which at this point is probably better. But I don't want to do that yet. So let's see if we can. Is that gonna I should break it out entirely, right? I think. Let's see. Let's see if that breaks it out entirely. Deuce defense. It didn't break it. That's unfortunate. But this should. Uh, and if I'm going to do that, I'm going to do this. And then strong ass extremely heavy damage oh and then oh because it was a free action we get another another action here um, honestly I don't want to but let's do it again I guess Every little bit of damage works, so oh, it's gonna be broken anyway, so that's fine. Um, bonk, bing, bonk. Ooh, strong hit, 199. Good stuff. Cool. look at that, though. Uh, that's gonna be a strong fucking hit. So, I think I'm gonna do... <laughs> I'm gonna do a defense. And then... Probably a shield regen. After the fact, which should bring us back to full. I suppose the alternative is that I do a stun, right? Do a stun with this guy. Take it entirely off the timeline for one turn. Seems like the time to do it, right? Oh, we don't have enough fury to do this combo attack anyway, which would have been a stun. Damn, one short. Does this get... Will this give us... Fear? Oh, I guess we don't have Fury at the start of the turn, so it's not going to happen. Uh, here, let me read about Fury once. Uh, this? Oh, back. Here we go. Landing crits and breaks on the enemy. Crits generate one Fury, or breaks generate three Fury. Okay. So, like, we would have enough, but not in time to use it. Okay, that's fine. You know what? Let's do this, then. Just take him entirely off the timeline. Which is enough there. Oh, except that... Did that use? That must have burned Fury. Damn. Ah, oh, that was dumb. I shouldn't have done it that way, then. Oh well. Okay. Well, let's do that. And then... Let's just do another crit there. Let's hit 110 blast. Okay, and now it's... 
Ooh, that's a group attack against everybody. Probably fine. Uh, what else can we do here? It's not gonna be able to break again. Okay. That's fine. Everybody's full, they can afford to take that hit, I think. Alternative is to defend. Well, do we defend with everybody then? So that'll save. Save most of our stuff, but we're already almost done with the shield, anyways. Doesn't matter. Alright, get. Burning three, weak stagger. What's the difference between Sunder and Slash? Yeah, they're both normal attacks. That one does less stuff. It's got more of a crit bonus to it. 15-9 versus 18-1. So it bypasses armor. Does more damage to armor, I suppose. Yeah, let's do it that way. I'll just do that. Take his shield down entirely. Do additional armor damage here. Ooh, big hits. Big hits all the way around. Everybody's shield pretty much down. Okay, that's fine though, because now we've got... Break him the fuck out of there. Beam. What is that going to do? 124. Oof. Uh. Because <laughs> how much how much health does he have the way it is? 70 or 112? What happens if I defend? Will that keep him from dying? Yeah, it will. But if we break him into next turn anyway, it's not going to happen here. So let's just go ahead and do that. Give us a free turn for everybody else, right? That's the important part. Um, and then do extra heavy hit here. Right? It'll be 67 plus 34, so 101. One oh one there, and then this guy is saved for another turn. Um, so I might want to actually then defend our dude here, just in case, you know? I mean, I don't really like him, but it doesn't mean he has to die. Um, okay, so he's fully powered up on his shields again. Nice 104. like to see that. Some extra health damage there. Alright, and now he's not moving. So now we really need to defend, prevent a death here. Uh, we could still do a big hit here, I think. Do we have anything that can... No, because he's not going to be broken anymore. Okay, let's do a big hit there, and then... Just a normal hit there, and then we'll just have to hope that our spiritual robot dude survives. Yep, he's fine. Okay. He's alright. Let's get right up in there. Boy. Here. Oh no. What are you... Um, what the heck? Oh no. Phase 2. <laughs> oh no, what does that mean? What is he doing? What is he gonna do? Oh, he's going to regain some shield. Alright, we need to make sure that doesn't happen. Oh, we still don't have enough fury to, to do this. Um, okay, can we... We can break him out of this... turn like this, right? Ah, uh, but then he's going to... He's going to retaliate, it looks like. 
That's probably fine, though, right? Probably fine. Um, what if we do this? No, that'll be a kill shot for sure. So whoever attacks him is going to take the brunt of the attack, or brunt of the counter, right? Which might be a, a good time to do this, then, with our front runner. At least break him out of that turn. And then give shields back to our front runner, right? And I don't know what to do with this guy. Actually, I don't know what to do with this guy. What did... Okay, hold on a second. When, when was the attack gonna happen here? Oh, right there, right? Okay, so let's do that. And then I don't know who goes first between these two. I'm gonna hope it's her. Yeah, it looks like it's gonna be her. So then let's give her shields back. Okay, good. It's fine. You know, pretty tiny counter. Plus a little bit of extra burning. Oh, that counters both. Great. Okay, never mind. Did not uh, pay attention to that. Oops. Okay, but that does give us a small... Oh, yes. Okay, now we've got big attack here, plus stun. Big attack plus stun, plus burning, plus bleeding. <laughs> but also counters on both, so that's a... That's a small issue, but we'll, we'll deal. Just do it. Or maybe just counter on this guy, which, yeah, okay, just counter on him, which, all right, he's a little hurt, but now that fucko is stunned, so we get another turn to think about what we're doing. Still doing Overwatch counters there, I don't like it. Okay, let's give this guy his shields back then. Okay, good, good burning there. Uh, all right, he's... That's so little. Is that going to be a kill shot there? It's hard to say. Because what if we do just like the biggest ass attack we can do? It's going to be 67, 34, and he's got 138 left. I think either way, it just depends on who we're going to give the kill to, right? So we may as well go... Well, we're not going to make him attack, right? So why don't you just defend? And we'll do big attack there. And I guess this guy's going to go first anyways, right? But he'll survive. He'll live. That's the important part. He'll do his attack first. He'll get the counter. But he'll live. And then we get big attack to finish the job. There we go. See? That's the power of planning. Everybody lives. Everybody lives. Except that guy. That guy's dead. <laughs> that guy's fucking toast. Uh, Alright, we managed to keep the Titan Core, blah 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 blah. Yeah, we did it. And we had new intelligence, there was another appearance this time in Narosh. He's got to turn in another behemoth, whatever. We did, we killed one, and we can kill another one. Uh, is there another chance? Yeah, 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 rest up and get some credits and get some stuff and get some recruits. And do whatever. Excellent. And now this entire area is free, I suppose, yeah? Actually, is it free? Is there anything of value to go back this way? No, okay. Did see some free floating credits. Plus we got some DNA to do some upgrades and shit. Um, so let's get our spoils first. Oh, these are shops. Weapons? Gadgets? There's the... Some recruitment. You get an Aegis. Or an Empath.
And then here's like everybody else in the resistance or the renegades or whatever the fuck. They're like, yeah, we won. Like, dipshits, you didn't do nothing. I did everything. Um, alright, let's see what we got here. Oh, nice. Okay. Okay, so we can't really, yeah, okay, so different shit can equip different stuff. Extra 10 seconds stagger on light attacks, 15% damage versus shields, and counter attacks, I like that. Can anybody equip that, though? Ablative vest, which is armor, more armor and more health, I like that. More health and resist pulse damage. I don't know what pulse damage is. I guess it's an element, right? Oh, I see. So we get one, like, weapon slash equipment, an implant, and uh, whatever this miscellaneous is at the end here. Okay, so that's what's available there. And what, what was over here? Oh, more. More weapons. Oh, that yeah, was gadget. This is weapons. Yeah, for weapons. A nitro blade. Um, penetrates armor, inflicts chilled for. Okay, so ice. Um, concussive blaster. Staggers 10 seconds, inflicts rattled three. Stagger by 15% more. Blocked by shields and armor. Boo. Um, but it's faster for light attacks, which I don't mind. Uh, laser gauntlets 4 versus pyro gauntlets 1. Deals 2 to 4 armor. Pretty sick. Blocked by shields and armor, though. Uh, well, at least that effect is. Particle rifle, which nobody can equip. So we don't have the appropriate uh, class that can equip that, I guess. Alright, well, it seems wise to... We've got money, right? So, yoink. Oops, I should have equipped it right away. I didn't. Then, uh, yoink. And then let's equip the thing. Oh, how do I... How do I equip it? I'll equip it. Why not... How, how, how equip? <laughs> Damn it. Alright, hold on a second. Figure this out. Uh, let's not do that. I want to equip your shit. There we go. Um, insufficient level. Oh, he needs to be level 4 to equip it! Fucking boo! Alright, well that uh, informs my level ups, I guess. Here, take a level up, I guess. You've earned it, sort of. Ah, that annoys me. All right, sell that, I guess, for a buck. I see. I thought that was the level of the equipment, not the level I needed to use the equipment. All right, whatever. Okay, and then we bought the gun for other dude here, right? We've got 32 buckos left. Um, do I want to recruit um, Deanna Troy or <laughs> who the hell is in Ages? Oh, hey, all right. Uh, saving the galaxy is more important. Um, it's like a defensive class, yeah. I wish I could view more details before we do that. Um. Psionic attacks, healing power. Okay, a healer. A healer? A healer seems good. Um, can I... I really want to look at details before we do this. Can we recruit them both? Is that the deal here? I don't mind a healer. Ah, uh, see, we can only recruit one of them, though. Damn it, I wish they had told me that. Well, too late. Alright, well, can our healer take an upgrade or two, then? Uh, only one? More health, 
and the inspire power up, I suppose. Which is here. Free action. Uh what what does that mean? Extra action this round. Oh, okay, so whoever we target with it gets another attack. I like that. That's good stuff. You know, not unreasonable. Shields, low health though. That's gonna be a problem. Well. Let's see if our 32 buckos can help that out. Ah, the level fours all the way around. Boo! What about a weapon? Can we give our healer, like, a fucking scalpel or something? Oh, apparently, apparently the healer can equip gauntlets. I shouldn't have sold my... fire gauntlets. <laughs> Damn it. Whoops. Alright, well, equip, uh... Recruit first and then equip second, I guess, is the lesson. Alright. Uh, that's probably good for spendies and shit. Um, okay. Well, then we're at a pretty good time to stop, actually. We did one full-ass mission on top of the, like, the tutorial bits. I feel like that's a pretty good thing. Let's go ahead and save and exit, and then we'll pick this up next time. Always good to end on a victory, really. Can't really ask for more than that. Okay, uh, so that'll do it for tonight. Oops. Um, next stream will be Wednesday night, 7 p.m. CDT. We'll be back here to Star Renegades. Pick up the adventure where we left off. Thursday, 7.30 p.m. CDT, will be Shmup Book Club. Some more, uh, Universe, or Ginga Force, or Spring and Mark II. Friday, Saturday, we're off, and then Sunday, 7 p.m. CDT, we'll be back to Long Play. So more Talos Principle 2, uh, more work on the Road to Elysium DLC puzzles. Should be fun, should be fun. All right, that'll do it for tonight. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you on Wednesday. Bye-bye.